Hello everyone, welcome to the course Expansive Soil. I am Dr. Anil Kumar Misra, working as an associate professor at the Department of Civil Engineering at IIT Guwahati. We will be delivering the lectures on the expansive soil. Before going into the details about the course, first I would like to briefly introduce about the expansive soil. Expansive soil is a problematic soil and it is uh, occur in many parts of the world, particularly arid and semi-arid regions. In semi-arid and arid regions, the soils are mostly dried because uh, evaporation of the water will be significantly higher in comparison to rainfall. So, therefore, the soil always have a tendency to absorb moisture. During the monsoon season or during the rainy season, the soil will absorb moisture and it will undergo an increase in the volume. Similarly, during the drying season, the soil will lose water and it will shrink. So, this uh, swelling and shrinkage phenomena will occur regularly and as a result of which the soil will undergo heaving and shrinkage continuously. As a result of this, any structure above the soil will undergo distressed and the structure will be damaged. Similarly, the drying of the soil associated stability problem to the embankment and earth dam and this lead to a considerable construction defects if not adequately taken care of. So, therefore, such soils are considered natural hazards and poses challenges to civil engineers. Most part of the world has this expansive soil, mostly Argentina, Australia. In India, around 20 percent of our land mass is covered by this expansive soil. It is known as the black cotton soil. Mostly it is uh, present in the Deccan Plateau, Western Madhya Pradesh, parts of Gujarat, Andhra Pradesh, Uttar Pradesh, Karnataka and Maharashtra. And with rapid developments in urban infrastructure, the expansive soil problems has becomes more evident. Therefore, it need to be addressed and it need to be learned. The main objective of this course is to give some idea uh, on expansive soil to the students, researchers, design engineers and the site engineers about the problem related with the expansive soil and providing them a basic knowledge on handling the problems in a much systematic and scientific manner. The course primarily designed for undergraduate and postgraduate students of civil engineering, researchers working in the field of ground improvement or geotechnical geoenvironmental engineering, design and site engineers who are dealing with the construction at this expansive soil sites. The course has been covered in 20 hours of lecture and it has been divided in 10 module. In this course, first we will learn about the introduction to soil mechanics in which I will briefly introduce about the different aspects of soil mechanics, the engineering behavior of the soil, the index properties of the soil such that the participants they will learn little bit about the introduction to the soil mechanics. Then we will go to the clay mineralogy in which I will be explaining in details about different type of clay minerals, their formation, their basic units and their behavior. Then I will start with the introduction to expansive soil. Here I will be discussing more about the expansive soil, its engineering behavior, its properties and the problem associated with expansive soil. Then we will be discussing about the swelling behavior of expansive soil, how a soil expands when there is an increase in the water content, what are the different factors which controls the expansive behavior and how this expansiveness changes with different other factors. Similarly, we will be understanding about the shrinkage phenomenon of the soil, then we will learn about the swelling and shrinkage behavior which occurs in a cyclic manner or cyclic swelling shrinkage behavior and on what factors this cyclic swelling behavior depends and how they impact soil. Then we will understand about different behavior of the expansive soil. Finally, I will be explaining about different treatment related to the expansive soil, how an expansive soil at the site will be dealt with. In the next, we will be dealing with uh, any foundation design on expansive soil, how the foundations will be constructed. Then we will learn about the engineering application of expansive soil such as landfill liner 
or nuclear waste repository. So, these are the few textbooks which will be followed. At the end of this course, the participants will have a better understanding on the fundamental behavior of expansive soil, then how different uh, problems associated with the expansive soil and how to solve those things. Then the students will be learning how to design a foundation on expansive soil and lastly they will be learning about different research which is currently going on on expansive soil. So, I hope you all have a very fruitful learning and hope this course will orient you in a better understanding on expansive soil and dealing with the problem associated with it. Thank you very much. Looking forward to see you in this course. Thank you.